We've all been there. You're trying to have a nice outdoor picnic or dinner from the grill, but you keep getting pestered by pests. Here to offer some advice is Jay Tucker, a branch manager with PMSI. Thanks for coming on. This is something, especially for me, mosquitoes love me. And I tell you, especially this summer, we have a nice outdoor patio. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so anyway, I was going to ask, what is the most common type of pest that people will find, you know, as they're trying to enjoy the outdoor weather? Yeah, sure. Well, one thing y'all actually posted yesterday, there's a huge uptick in bees this summer. Um, one thing most homeowners don't realize, of the 20,000 species of bees, about 70% live underground. Okay. So people are looking for hives around their house. Oh they're not sure where they're coming from, but 70%, so about 14,000 species, are actually underground. Um, so a lot of those home remedies that people have to treat hives will also work for the ones underground. They just don't realize to look for them. Um, so it's similar to an ant hole, except for obviously a little bigger because of the body size. Wow. Um, so they like being around the base of plants. Um, where they have a little more shelter and are provided uh, protection from other things. So bees, any other kinds of things that people find a lot in this area? Ants, mosquitoes, like you said, um, and a lot of them, it's similar to the inside of your home. You really just want to make sure you're cleaning the outside as good as you are the inside. That's one of the best ways to prevent those type of things. Yeah, so I, yeah. So how do you get rid of them? I mean, what do you do? So uh, if you, you know, you can Google it and there's all kinds, basically every house I go to, they have a different remedy that I'd never <laughs> heard of before. Um, that their great grandfather taught them, or something like that. Um, some people use, you know, vinegar spray, uh, boric acid type stuff. Um, but you know, it, it, like I said, there's a lot of different things you can do. How um, do you know if it's something you can do, or if you need to call in somebody like PMSI for help? Yeah, sure. I mean, how do, how do you make the the call? Um, I mean, it's more a personal thing. Some people don't mind getting stung or don't mind getting bothered by them. Uh, you know, if it gets to the point where it's something you don't think you can handle, where there's so many, it's a large infestation, um, you know, we're obviously there to help, um, you know, and we do free consultations. So we'll come take a look and, you know, we might even say, hey, here's a way you could get rid of this problem. Or, you know, if it's to a certain degree, we'll say, hey, let us come in, we'll take care of it. This is what that's going to look like for you. So what does that look like? You, you do an inspection first. How much does that cost? It's a free inspection. It, okay. So we'll come out. Um, we'll take a look around the house. I do those myself. I love going out and, you know, keeping on my toes and making sure I know what's going on out there. Um, so we'll come. We'll look around the outside of your house. We'll look around the inside of your house. Even if there are problems you might not have known you'd have, we'll point those out to you, tell you ways that you might be able to fix them or ways that we can help. Um, and then we kind of go from there. Most homes are on a, a quarterly type plan where we're coming out and taking care of things with unlimited free service calls in between. Um, but we also do restaurants, office buildings, um, and the Virginia Tech facilities as well as one of our big Perfect. groups down here that we're working with. Well, thank you so much. And we will put, we've got the website right there on the screen if anybody wants more information or how to get in touch with you so that they can get help getting rid of those pests. Thanks again for coming on.